What's up everyone, welcome back to another video on my channel, JTube Gaming. Today is another tutorial video. Um, I saw that my Roblox GFX profile picture was a very popular video on my channel, actually the most popular. It's about to hit 1k views, um, like any day, maybe like 2 weeks later. Well, someone asked in the comment, how do you like pose and move the rig? Well, that's exactly what I'm doing today. So, um... First, what we need to do is we need to get Roblox Studio. You can go to base plate, flat terrain, actually anything. Uh, as long as um, you can like import your character. So the plugin that we're gonna be using today is Moon Animator or Load Character and Building Tools by F3X. So in order to get these, you need to go um, to Home and you click Toolbox right there. Over here, you will go to plug, plug plugins, and after that, you will get load character, light, and moon animator. You can actually choose any of them, but I prefer moon animator because it's um sort of easier to use, in my opinion. So this is the moon animator. There's fire explorer. We're gonna use character inserter, so we can actually like insert any character we want. So today, I'm gonna insert my Jotaro avatar. There we go. That's Jotaro. So just like click here, and it if we're clicking over there, you can like click over here, and it will light up. Or you can just click over there. So just go, just click the arrow here, and I will show you all of these things. So there's left foot, left hand, left lower arm. Yeah, you see a lot of a lot of things. Well, um, you can like pose them using the building tools and also for the building tools you also need to go to home toolbox and then there we go building tools by f3x you gotta search it i think so over here we got the move tool for example we put like the right foot and then you can move like our right foot over there we put like our um um example our right hand we can actually like move the right hand up but mostly I use the rotate because it's like easier I think for me. Well um you can get the left lower arm over here and then there's like a right upper arm. So we can just like move it like that. Then we can get like the left lower arm. If we can just move the W A S key. We can actually like move our avatar can actually see how we're moving it like over there then you can use the right lower arm i think was it the right lower arm yes it was the right lower arm i think wait no 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 it was the right hand right hand is this one you can rotate it so it looks like going the hand is going up like that and after that since it's like that we can like move up a bit and like move it like that then we can like basically like pose anything we want for 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 me it's actually kind of hard because i um it's like an r15 but if you guys want to like move the whole arm i prefer you to use the r6 version well you can use the load character for well, this one we can just um pick the right hand and we can like downwards a bit it's not working so yeah this is why we need the building tools so this one we can just like move it anywhere we want well i don't know why it's just stuck like that like but when i move it it's like um it like kind of like goes down like too far well um you can just like do that but then it goes down too far also so we do not want that to happen so um you can actually just use a r16 one if you like want to move the whole arm like i said like spawn r6 and there should be me over there there should be j2 so you can actually just like pick any part we want like move our character but then again click this arrow 
then after that it's like only simple like this so if you want left arm you can just like move the whole arm and not only like the like the parts of the arm for example like this we can just like do it like that then if we do that it kind of goes like too high so yes i do not really know how to fix this but um i will do some more research i think <laughs> um but yes this is like how how i do it sometimes i only like oh you can spin it like that i didn't know that <laughs> okay so you can just like spin it like that and you see over there it's like and yeah it's like up there like the arm so you can actually just like move anything around like example if you're making a game or gfx you can just do this and then after that you can go to jtube again export selection like that so yeah guys thank you for watching my video if you want more tutorials please leave what tutorial i should do in the comments below and see you in the next video peace out goodbye <laughs>